Okay, today is Friday, March 27, 2015, and I'm here talking with Stephanie from the one and only restaurant that there is in Windermere. Stephanie, why did your family choose Windermere as a home? It stands apart from everything that we've seen prior to moving to Orlando. Um, the small town feel, the quaintness, uh, the landscaping, it really, from the first time it was love at first sight. And why did you choose to start your restaurant, Dixie Cream Cafe? Well, I chose Windermere for my restaurant because I couldn't believe that nobody else had. And it was by luck that I was fortunate to drive by and see a very small sand sign um, sticking out of the ground. I had been looking to find a restaurant. I had been spending months. And at the time, I had been driving around the area looking for a home, a, another home to downsize to. I saw the sign and it said for lease. I said that cannot be possible because who would not want to have a business right here? And I met with the landlord and we hit it off. And I was a happily married woman to Dixie Cream Cafe <laughs> in my heart. And then we ran into a few issues uh, with the, the way that the, the town is set up in terms of you know, being with a city on utilities and so forth. But I had fallen in love. And um, here we are going on to our five years. Five years, yes, yes. And it's, it's every day. It's wonderful. That's good. That's good. And your restaurant has grown, right? The restaurant has grown uh, in terms of um, customers, guests coming in, hearing about us, um, what a quaint town. People have moved to Windermere and they hear about the restaurant or they come to the restaurant and find out about the town. We get a lot of new people looking for homes mm -hmm. and um, we get so many repeat customers coming in. It really is where the locals go. And uh, we love that. What are your two favorite places in Windermere? Apart from your restaurant. Apart from my <laughs> restaurant, exactly. I love the town hall. I love, I love just what the opportunities it presents itself. You can go in there and find people playing cards that have been playing cards for ages, or you can find two kids that are getting married to embark on a new life. But it really is a place where memories are made. That's one of my favorite places. And the second place is on Oakdale, where the Windermere Union Church used to be located. Is there a park? Is a park behind right. there? And my kids played there uh, over 25 years ago, and I always remember that area. What is one place that you wish was still around, and why? Finders Keepers. Okay. Finders Keepers was run by uh, Alice. I don't know her last name, but to this day, I still have people asking, "Is Finders Keepers still here?" Finders Keepers is no longer here, but Alice is still around. <laughs> she no longer lives here, but she comes and visits. And I wish I had had more chances of seeing Finders Keepers as I was building the restaurant, but I do wish it was still here. Give us a six word memoir of your life here in Windermere. Blessed to be <laughs> in a place of love. I think that's a... <laughs> that's <laughs> what you encapsulated what you, the place is all about. And, and what is it to me? What is Windermere to me? It's home. It will always be home. When I moved here from South Florida, uh, it was because of my husband's job. And I thought, coming from a city, oh, this is really a change of pace. And I thought, well, you know, maybe for a year or two. And here we are, <laughs> 30 years later, 30 years later. And I've seen growth, but I've seen things remain. And I think that's kind of the hard thing with Windermere especially, because you have a lot of residents that have lived here for a very long time. And to see things kind of growing in a way that maybe they don't want them to, it's a little bit hard. And I understand both sides of it. So we're, we're happy that we were able to get a, a place that people can Call home and our tagline at our restaurant is where somebody knows your name. That's true. Yes. <laughs> okay. Yeah. And sticking to the dirt roads. Sticking to the dirt roads. I I love the dirt roads. 
it surely makes for a messy car, but I love the dirt roads. It keeps the it keeps the charm <laughs> about yes. about Guinevere. Okay. Thank you very much. You're welcome.